Hello and welcome to Animated Talk. This particular work is The Persistence of Memory by Salvador Dali. It is oil on canvas and it can be found at the Museum of Modern Art in New York. This particular work was created in 1931 in Spain and it is considered a work of surrealism. You can find the reading that I'm about to give to you on page 459 of 10,000 Years of Art by Phaidon. The persistence of memory is a classic instance of the hallucinatory vision of the surrealist painter Salvador Dali, whose lifespan was 1904 to 1989. He emulated the thought processes of the mentally disturbed to invent shocking, strange dream scenes in paint. A number of Dali's light motifs inhabit this bleak landscape. Melting clocks warp the stability of time. Ants swarm over the metal as if it were de decaying flesh, and a monstrous, mask-like thing, a hybrid of a head and a horse, lies limp and abandoned. The creature's profile resembles the artist's, making it at once alarmingly recognizable and alien. Persistence of memory evinces the same detailed accuracy of Grant Wood's American Gothic, which was painted a year earlier, yet in place of an American moral tale or rural scene, it depicts a grotesque and macabre subconscious domain. After being expelled from art school in Madrid in 1926, Dali began to achieve public acclaim for his work, which revealed the influence of Giorgio de Chiricho's metaphysical painting. In 1929, Dali collaborated with his former classmate Luis Buñuel of the I'm sorry, on the iconoclastic film Unchin Andalu. The film caught the attention of André Breton, leader of the Surrealists, and Dali soon joined the movement. His eccentricity and pursuit of notoriety, alongside his artistic talents, made this artist Surrealism's best-known representative. Thank you for joining me today, and please continue to come back to Animated Talk for more discussion about art and other creative subjects. Bye-bye.